What's up gamers and welcome back to episode 5 of my Oshawott only playthrough of Pokemon Black. This episode should be a lot easier and probably be shorter because I won't need to do as much training since, if any at all, since the next gym is ground and I Oshawott's a water type so it should be pretty easy to beat the next gym, shouldn't have any problems, should be smooth sailing. I know all we have to do is really just cross the bridge and then go into the like little storage unit the ice storage unit and then once we're through there we can just attempt the gym so let's get right to it uh as always here's oshawott oswald summary quick summary level 42 water pulse aqua tail aqua jet and swords dance i feel like swords dance could become useful maybe later or if i want to use aqua jet or if i get waterfall maybe and i know i get surf after this next gym so that'll become really useful and the lucky egg uh, before we go into Mr. Alton Cave or whatever it is. Uh, I know we get the... Oh, I forgot. I know we get the lucky egg and then it'll be useful for training and getting ready for the Elite Four and everything. I forgot we had a rival battle with Charon here, so we'll see how this goes. I think he just has the same team. Tranquil, uh, Lipard... Servine and one more that I'm forgetting. But we'll just water pulse here. Oh, I forgot they always go for fake out and it annoys me so much because you flinch every single time. But water pulse should be able to take it out. Nice. Okay, now we have Servine. This will be a little bit tougher. 26, I'm 16 levels above. What am I talking about? This won't be too bad. Unless they like crit or something. Okay, Leech Seed, not the best thing. But just a couple more. As long as it doesn't like Mega Drain or Giga Drain the whole time. Water Pulse should be like, shouldn't take too long to kill it with Water Pulses. Leaf Tornado. Okay, let's see how much this does. Wow. And the Leech Seed. I'm just gonna... <sighs> no way I lose this. I can't take any more, so I'll just heal on this one. i use a Hyper Potion. Growth? Okay. And the Leech... The Leech Seed is just so annoying. Because I really can't do any damage to this thing. Uh, should we Swords Dance up and Aqua Tail? Maybe that's the play. Another growth. Okay. Um, I'm worried now. I'm going to die to the next one. Well, Oshawott, if there was a time to crit, it would be now. Please. Oh, okay, I can take it on one more, though, as long as it didn't choose a hitting attack. Okay, that's cool. Right? The Leech Seed. How much will that do? How much will that heal? Oh, I can't take it out, actually. And it avoided the attack. Well, this was not how I expected this episode to go. I didn't know I'd die already. This is the first time we've lost to Charon. Uh, well, I, I'm sure we can beat it. I, know, I think the Swords Dance Aqua Tail is the move, so... I'll come back when I'm about to try again. Attempt two. Here we go. It's really just that stupid leech seed that sets everything up. But maybe if I can get two swords dance off when he does leech seed and then maybe a growth. And then I just outspeed and if it hits, it'll probably one shot. So, Or maybe, no, I'm going to set up here on this Lipard. That's what I should have been doing. Because this doesn't really have any moves that can really do any damage or take me out. So I'll swords dance here. Yeah, Pursuit's fine. I'll, maybe I'll do two or three Swords Dances. Pursuit again, yep, fine. I'm just gonna try to sweep. I'll put one more and then just go for Aqua Tails. Perfect. So I already know I can one-shot this thing. As long as I don't miss, I forget what Aqua Tail, like, what the accuracy is. And I should be able to live one Leaf Tornado, just in case it misses. Boom, there's one. 
Servine, okay. I outspeed, so I'm just gonna Aqua Tail again. Boom, should be dead. Three Swords Dance. Yep, good. And now I just sweep. Oh, Panpour. Alright, that's the fourth one. I, I'm i recording this so late at night, I'm so tired. Hopefully I'm able to even focus in order to finish this recording. And here's the Tranquil, like I said. Okay, well that's going to be the strat now. I'm just going to try to set up and then sweep. Especially when I get, like, I think Waterfall is another physical attack move. It just sucks that my Oshawott has low... Um, attack to begin with in his nature. Oh, I forgot now. I have to do this like double double battle thing with the little kids. Oh, that was a whole lot of nothing, so I'm probably just going to end up cutting that out. Now, oh, on to my favorite city, or one of my favorite cities in this game. The music is just so amazing, and well, it's always raining whenever. I know that's a meme, like it's always raining there, so We'll see if it is this time or not, but here goes the bridge, and then, like I did with the Castilia City, I'm just going to play the music for a little bit, because it's just so nostalgic and enjoyable to listen to. Please let me go over. Alright, it is time. Oh wait, they're going to talk to me first, aren't they? Oh, I love this music so much. And now, like, all I can think about whenever I hear this song is, like, the dancing toothless meme. I'll probably put a little, like, image of him. And it's just, it, I've saw it all over my TikTok for, like, three weeks. Every other video would be this song and then dancing toothless. But, it's such a good meme and such a good song. I love this city. Oh wait, let me get the Rocky Helmet just for... Because I remember I mentioned it earlier, but I used to like have Rocky Helmet on my Samurott, and it would... I don't know why, but it was like the first time I ever put an item on a Pokemon. Okay, and I know I don't have to battle all these trainers in here, I just have to get through and then inside the container, then I have to battle, so I'm just not going to battle these guys if I don't have to, like in case I run into them. But here we go, just around. I wish they had more ice mazes in different gyms. Like, I forget which game it's in, but there's one where you have to like, step on the floor the correct way and clear all the ice in order to battle the gym leader. And I wish they had more stuff like that instead of just like the type matchups or whatever. Oh, there's no way he just faked me out like that. Oh shoot, I was just gonna like speed through this and then cut back, but here we go, Hydro Pump. Okay, special, 120 and 80 accuracy. Well, this is 60, I think I'm gonna keep Aqua Tail as my main move, and then just have this here. Like, the confusion is good and all, but 90 accuracy and 90 power, I think that would make my more damage. So I'm just gonna get rid of this, I'm taking a risk. It'll, it'll become useful. Cool. So, I think that, yeah, that was literally the last guy. Now we can go into here, and then battle all the trainers. Oh, wait. Go here. Yeah, all the Team Plasma mem members. Wow, the game froze. That's crazy. All right, well, I'll I'll come back once I'm back to the spot. Okay, I'm back here before I entered the uh, storage unit. I I don't know what that was. It's never really glitched like that before before playing on this emulator. So um, maybe it won't happen again. Hopefully, it doesn't happen again. But beating these guys gets repetitive, so I'll just cut back once I'm out of here and I'm ready to go take on the gym. Okay, I believe that's the last one. 
Now I'm able to go get ready and take on Clay once he gets out of here. Um, like I was saying, this like this episode will be pretty short. It's just going because there's not a lot of like not a lot to do between the fourth and um, fifth gym. It's basically just walk across the bridge, go into this little storage unit, and, and fight like 14 plasma members, and then you're able to take on the gym already. Which I'm not complaining. It'll let me get this episode up um, a little sooner. Because usually it takes me a couple days for the recording since I don't have that much time. I'm busy with like work, school, and um, just like chilling, I guess, going to the gym. Uh, and like I'm always tired at night and I go to sleep pretty early and then wake up early to go to the gym. So I never really have time during the day. So it takes me a couple days to record and then a couple days to find time to edit. Even though the editing doesn't take that long anymore, I just kind of like cut pieces together when I'm not talking. But it's nice to have a shorter episode so I can just get this one up and out to you guys as quick as possible. I also keep forgetting that I have a bike, so I'll start to use it more. And I think I'm just gonna heal and then go directly to the gym. I It has a level 29 Croc Rock, 29 Palpitoad, and a 31 Excadrill. I think I should be able to take it out first try. Oh, I'm also excited for like the gym layout. Like I think uh, this Trafail City gym is one of my favorite like layouts of a gym and favorite like puzzles. Because some of the puzzles are like way too easy. Like the typing ones or like Berg's gym where you just have to walk through the little honey or whatever. Like I wish they made them a little more challenging. Even though it makes sense that they're not that challenging because it's a kids game. But if they were a little more challenging, I would like it. But this one's definitely one of my favorite, like, gym layouts and designs. Because I like the whole, like, elevator thing, going down into a mine. And the next one's one of my favorites also, where you're just, like, shooting into the sky and, like, breaking your nose on the wall. But let's just get into this. I think you have to fight three trainers here. Like, I was just thinking about it, um, in one of the earlier Pokemon games where you have to, like, find the key in the trash can or whatever. I know it's mostly RNG. I, I, yeah, I think it's RNG. It might be, like, knowing where it is. But, something like that. I wish there was more RNG gems in this game. Like, the dragon one's cool also. But, if there was, like, something to make it a little harder to get through, I would've liked that. But these should be straightforward. Maybe I'll use like Aqua Jet just to save my PP on the Aqua Tail for the gym leader. So I'll just start using Aqua Jet now for the rest of these trainers. Um, I know like I've mentioned it, Arceus or not Arceus, Legend Z. I'm kind of sad that they didn't make a Pokemon Black and White 3, but it makes sense that they already have the second one, so it's fine that they skip it. And uh, Legends of Arceus, Legends Arceus was a good game, like I enjoyed it, so I'm excited to see like what they do for uh, Legends Z. And I like the Pokemon from that generation almost as much as uh, this generation. I just want to know the starters, really. Like, I know I was already spoiled in Legends Arceus because Oshawott was one of the starters, so I know he won't be one in this. But it'll be cool to see if there's any other starters that I like in it. I just hope it's a good game, good and polished game, because I want something else to spend my time playing. And I could probably record it for this cha channel, like, just my first playthrough of it. Okay, last one, I believe, then we go into the one that's caged, and then we're able to go down and fight Clay. I don't even think I'm gonna heal, I'm just gonna try to, like, do it first try. Hopefully I'm not too cocky and I just go in there and lose. I get one shot by the Crocorock. That would be, like, the worst case scenario. Okay. I think she just has this Trilver, right? Yeah, cool. Alright, I'm gonna save also, just in case it, like, freezes. I don't have to go back and do all this again. Okay, let's go down here, fight Clay. I don't think I'm going to set up on the Crocorock because it has Swagger, and if he raises my attack with Swagger, and then I raise my attack with Swords Dance, and I just end up hitting myself, 
it's just gonna do so much damage and I, I don't feel like dealing with that so I'll probably just do aqua tail hopefully I outspeed so I'll aqua tail first and then maybe set up on the palpitoad in order to get ready for the excadrill or maybe I'll just try to hydro pump everything and just be cocky but I think that's a bad plan so I'm just gonna aqua tail this and just so I can go to sleep and then get this out tomorrow morning probably after I go to the gym or maybe before I go if I wake up in time if I wake up early sometimes I just wake up at my first alarm and then I have like an hour and a half before I'm supposed to go to the gym and then I just go back to sleep for another like hour and then I don't have time to do anything in my mornings oh, okay he's sending out Excadrill instead of Palpitoad do I go for the Hydro Pump? he's probably in a home clause so I probably have a chance to do it yeah home clause Hopefully I can just be cocky and hit this Hydro Pump first try. Yes, Oswald the Goat. Easy, Jim. And then we just have a Palpitoad. I'll probably Hydro Pump it again. See if I can hit two in a row. And level 44. Cool, cool, cool. Next gym shouldn't be too bad either. The next couple. I'm just worried about the Dragon one because I'm. it's just such a good typing. And they're so strong. Nice, another Hydro Pump hit. Easy gym. Well, that'll do it for this episode. I will see you next time when I go to Gym 6 in Mistralton City and I take on Skyla.